Hi everyone, this is Rama of Japanglish to go. Hi everyone, this is Rama of Tayo TV, Japanglish to go. You're made in Japan English. Do subscribe first to our YouTube channel Tayo TV. Hit the notification bell for you to be notified of our latest programs and episodes. And do please leave a comment for any Japanglish or Gairaigo suggestion. Our Gairaigo for today is Y shirt. What is Y shirt in Japan? This is my first time to hear this word. Sumimasen, Roma-san. I always wear good Y shirt in Japan when I go to the uh, office. You mean you're wearing a business dress shirt? Dress shirt? What is dress shirt? Oh, I guess dress shirt is the way we call your Y shirt. Dress shirt is a formal shirt, just like what you're wearing right now. Um, usually for men, intended to be worn with jacket or tie or bow tie. Ah, wakarimashita. In Japan, we call it white shirt or white. Ah, you mean white shirt. Hi. Oh, I see. So, okay. Thank you so ah. much, Takahashi-san. So, remember guys, white shirt in Japan means business dress shirt. Just a short history background about white shirts. By the end of the Meiji era, people began wearing dress shirts. And at that time, dress shirts are only available in white. That's why they call it white shirts or hawaito in Japan before. However, the color white or the word white, it's quite difficult to understand or to pronounce to most of the Japanese speakers. That's why they intend to say it like the letter Y. And then by the Taisho era, people began referring white shirts into Y shirts. Well, that's it. Just a short history. And yeah, and if you also notice, most of the Japanese salary men when they go to the office or attending business meetings, they wear white shirts. So that's it for today. This is Rama once again giving you nothing but good vibes with Japanglish to go. You're made in Japan English. We'll certainly have more of the latest Japanese ins and outs. Name it, we have it. I hope you learned something new today and I shall see you again on my next video. Arigatou gozaimasu.